The Minnesota State Fair welcomed massive crowds to this year's great get-together. Now that the fair has finally come to an end, State Fair staff told our Josh Peterson that this year's fair was one for the record books. The unofficial end of summer is upon us, and as tradition in Minnesota, it ends with the Minnesota State Fair. This year, a combination of new attractions and ideal weather made for a great fair. Minnesota State Fair staff couldn't be happier. We really have Mother Nature to thank. We've had absolutely perfect weather, and, and that's really what's helped us along, I think. Fair officials say that when the streets are completely filled and seem like an endless sea of people, that means the fair is close to setting a record. We did set a record last Friday, and we also set a record yesterday, Friday. Um, so we do have two records already. Um, this day, it's, it's certainly busy out here. I think everyone can tell, and there's a chance for a record, but we'll see. With a record set this past Saturday of 260,000 people who attended the fair, the 2014 record of 225,000 was shattered. No, it doesn't matter. Just the fact that people are out and enjoying the fair is all we care about. Now that the fair has officially come to an end, it will only be a matter of weeks before preparations for next year's fair get underway. Well, every year after the fair, generally starting in October, we kind of wrap everything up in September. And then starting in October, we go into planning meetings and start thinking about ways we can improve for 2017. Reporting from the Minnesota State Fair in Falcon Heights, I'm Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. The official final attendance numbers for this year's fair are expected to be released later this week. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.